Angelo here. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back. Here's my stream. So guys, we are going over. This is a coming soon event because I guess this will be all happening on the 16th. So roughly not tomorrow's update, the 9th. It'll be the week after. So about eight or nine days ish. We'll see this. So basically just kind of covering it what this is. Feast with friends. I guess we're going to do. Uh, it's a daily uh, Arkesian feast of daily rewards and a new class full of tricks, plus new items in store. There's Arkesian feast, uh, harvest time in Arkesia, log in daily to stock up on rewards, stockpile as much as you can. The winter looks very cold, cruel, and demonic. And then, of course, the Reaper is coming. So, all you Reaper fanboys and gals, you can get your new class. I don't know if it's a class for me, but, you know, if people like it, you know, hey, there it is. And then some new store items that are popping in are going to be... I think these are the fan ones that in Korea might have just got. So that's kind of cool that they're giving them to us as well, if that's what I think they are. There's nothing to click on as of yet. Like I said, we'll see it. And then obviously the uh, custom Reaper things. Now, in addition to that, guys, they were talking about this. So basically there's a Lost Ark uh, Academy for the Reaper thing. Um... Now, again, I'm, I'm not very big on it, so if you do want it, there's basically it breaks it all down. There's a persona mode, normal mode, chaos mode. I think there's two different engravings, uh, what, hunger, lunar, lunar voice, things like that. So, again, it's not exactly a class that I like, but I'm sure if you want to check it out, you can either slow up the video or just kind of check it out. But and then, like, shadows, I mean, it looks like an interesting class, but to me, it's just, like, kind of a... It's a death blade with some shadow hunter skills. I don't know. That's just kind of what it looks like to me. So I'm not really interested. But the interesting part for me was this part right here at the bottom. It's called looking ahead. So looking ahead in next week's update, the Reaper will uh, release with two progression events, a Punica pass and a hyper express event that helps accelerate a character from item level 1302 to 1445 so if you have any characters in the 1370s 1302 this one will now instead of getting you to 1415 with that extra little buff we got last time this will now get you to 1445 so it'll at least get one character so if you just started the game your new main <laughs> new character We'll get you to 1445 if you already have you know again it's the same thing as always so all the ones we lost the puna capacity that we got for free uh you just gotta make sure you did um the berber's quest and you get it for free again easy level up 1302 and then you can take that and then do the 1445 so players will be able to designate one character between 1302 and 1445 on the roster to participate in the hyper express event where they'll earn honing materials and quickly level uh, level up quickly to 1445. The designated character will earn rewards and missions from increasing their item level to 1445, which grants a particular valuable reward. Let me guess. Faeons! <laughs> I'm just guessing. Faeons, maybe a legendary um, uh, random. I doubt they're going to give us any more selection uh, legendary cards. That would be nice, but I doubt it. And stay tuned to Play Lost Ark social media channels and uh, we'll have a full list of updates in next week's release. So this, like I said, this is just a coming soon. This is just kind of what we're getting there. Uh, and some major and some more Reaper tips from Grunton. Till then, we'll see you in Arkesia. In addition to that, I was kind of scoping around. And I was taking a look at some of the news and whatnot. Nothing amazing there. And then I did go through here, so... Right here, they're talking about on the forums. Uh, Heroes of Arkesia, all Lost Ark servers will be taken on Wednesday, November 9th. And uh, will be taken offline basically tonight, Tuesday night at midnight, the usual, for our weekly maintenance. And this is the interesting thing. Normally, it's four hours. Only three hours this time. Look at that. But here are some fixes, supposedly. So the Arc Pass weapon selection chest that were previously claimed and were set as character bound, which I did notice this is the ones if you go to your Arc pass so uh if you had your character in your arc pass then it would show you that the weapon was untradeable but everything else was roster bound now it's updated to be roster bound so there you go the description in the legendary uh card pack earned through the aldebaran uh harvest festival has been corrected this allows you to uh you to randomly obtain one legendary card and it's not a selection pack that's kind of weird i guess it you used to say selection pack, but you open it and use it. It's just a random. And then the uh, trading restrictions for the ship skin, Jack O' Lantern, the Wanderer are now accurately displayed in game. So I guess it's not tradable. Maybe it is tradable. No, no. But they said thank you for your patience, and we'll see you in Arkeja soon. And then a couple other topics that I saw here. So I was going through. I'm like, ooh, weekly tripods. So um, let me switch to this right here. So 
Dat Mods asked this question on Twitter, and he was asking, thank for juicing us with the 1445 Express event. Can we get confirmation on the tripod changes that are coming with the update? And according to the Play Lost Art guy here, yeah, they are. So there we go. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, so they're saying right here, Rox is saying the tripod system update has been confirmed for the November update since the last roadmap. No change here. Full details in the patch notes. A uh, big thing about that, guys, if you have any level 4 tripods, you got to save them to your library. If you save them to your library, it is now, when the new system comes in, you have a permanent level 4, aka level 5 tripod saved. So, now's the time. If you want, you buy some blue crystals, update your library, and I think one of these things we're talking about, it, yeah, right here, I think it was this ATK. Yeah, ATK or Zeals. Basically, they're telling you to prepare, you know, because then you can get it for free and you can select it. As you can see, you can, like, it shows you if you don't have anything, it's a level one. But then if you have, like, max level, level four, whatever you have, you see, like, there's a level five right there. Basically, yeah, if you want anything to be level five now and not have to constantly try and get it and get it and get it, you can buy it off the market and then do it that way. But, yeah, good luck. Hopefully, you get that thing set up. Um, so, not tomorrow's update. You have about eight, nine days. So, smash it out boys and uh oh yeah and then the last thing so this is something they're asking uh can we get a confirmation to use the express pass or power pass with reaper it means also for summoner do we have to save this one for summoner will it end before summoner this wasn't clarified at all thanks and then rocks not quite sure exactly what's what it's going to be because they didn't put a, a date on the punica pass and the express pass both of these characters are being released within a month of each other. I'd like to think they're going to allow it to last two months, and I doubt they're going to give us another one. So I'm guessing that this pass, you either use it for your Reaper or use it for your Summoner. Your pick, your choice, and uh, yeah, so we'll see. So again, they haven't confirmed. I guess we'll all find out on the 16th when the new tripod update happens, and we'll also see it when and how long these... Uh, these things last uh what was it this one right here the two um the hyper express and the punic pass would get for free so there we go guys that's just a coming soon on this one i guess it's feast with friends coming soon next week eight nine days let me know what you guys think in the comments below are you guys gonna make a reaper you're gonna make a summoner i'm making a summoner so like i said i'm gonna skip the reaper going for the summoner thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys Maybe tomorrow when they explain more, or I don't even know if it's tomorrow. I'll definitely have the, this full Feast of Friends when it's released. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys out there. Later.